so continuing from where we left off I'm gonna use a paper uh, just so it can give a card type feeling to our calendar for some reason my VS code didn't start properly so it's not giving me intelligence or auto importing then I'm just gonna use some typography to represent where different parts of it will be so the first one gonna be the controls and in this video we are gonna be building the controls now it has some uh, it is using some styles from the template so I'm just gonna remove them that's still not uh, working so it's because in the index in the main tsx file there is an index.css file that's been imported some padding to the page which was a bad decision and I will remove it later on I'm gonna create a separate file for the controls and create a functional component in, the, in it just gonna do some simple setup for it to check if TypeScript is working properly in the previous versions of white if you set up a template of TypeScript with react it uh, wouldn't work properly out of the box so you would have to change something so I just wanted to check if it was working properly now It seems to be working fine, so I'm just gonna remove them. Then I'm using a stack here again to align everything properly. Inside that, there is an other stack and then we just have the date the date will be formatted with moment and I'm gonna use the month and then the year format Then I'm gonna use an icon button from MUI and some icons for the forward and the backward arrow. For some reason it wasn't importing it so I did it manually. Uh, it's not showing it because we haven't imported our controls in the uh, main component file.
now if I refresh the page it's gonna show the controls hopefully if it loads this can take some time now now it is showing the controls but it's not aligned properly so I'm just gonna assign some styles to these uh, elements stack and other items I am basically copying these styles from when I made this calendar before Now for the stack with arrows, I'm just gonna give it a direction of row and change the size of the icons so they do not take up too much space. Also I'm keeping the color as primary, you can use others if you want. MUI has a good range of colors. Now there's a scroll bar, uh, horizontal scroll bar that's appearing on the screen. I'm just gonna try to remove it. solid and this is the color that MUI and other calendars that I have looked up on the internet also use this color so I'm I'm gonna use this same color at every border and in the next coming tutorials the main uh, horizontal scroll was caused by this padding and in the upcoming tutorials you will see why uh, this border color will be used everywhere okay so with that our basic controls are done now in this video we were just gonna make the designs for them and in the next one we will start working on the days grid and then we will work on their functionality